At first glance, these look like pictures from the everyday life of a house painter. But they're not ordinary at all. The location is the juvenile detention facility in Halford, North Rhine-Westphalia. The film was shot by young convicts behind bars and tells of their life in prison. <laughs> this is our shooting schedule. Normally it's marked in color, but I didn't get around to that. And these are pretty much the final scenes, which we can all easily make in our cells. 23-year-old Mirko is the director, screenwriter and leading actor. I've been serving time for more than three years, and I'll be here almost another three. I'm in for attempted murder. Mirko's film is about nightmares and the nightmare of daily life in prison. It can be watched on the internet portal Podknast. This is a site where young convicted offenders can show their films, from rap videos to documentaries. Und die Nadel weitergereicht hätte, hätte ich die anderen auch damit anstecken können. The films focus on anything and everything that interests the prisoners. To learn the value of a month, ask a mother who's had a premature baby. 22-year-old Rafaela wrote a poem about the value of time. Time waits for no one. To learn the value of an hour, ask lovers waiting to meet. To learn the value of a minute, ask someone who's missed a train, a bus, or a plane. To learn the value of a second, ask someone in prison for the first time. To learn the value of a millisecond, ask your heart and recognize your soul. To learn the value of time, trust God, and don't waste your life, but enjoy it. Time is God's way of keeping everything from happening all at once. Rafaela has no ambition to continue writing after he leaves prison. As a profession, it would be too stressful for me. But sure, I've written, for girls, for myself, when I want to express my feelings. Mirko's aim is to formulate his views too. I've been thinking about my own personal film now for four or five months. Mirko films from the limited viewpoint of prison, but with humor. This is our blinking machine, however odd that sounds. We're shooting the whole film from a first-person perspective. And instead of making cuts and fading to black, we blink because it's nicer to watch. For Mirko, the Podknas project gives meaning and a hint of freedom to the monotony of prison life. It means you're not just locked up. And above all, you can give your imagination free reign. You know what I mean? Simply experiment a little with the camera. If you're serious about this podcast and really have some ability, really have some skill, then you can work through your feelings and experiences and maybe motivate other people not to make the kinds of mistakes that will put them in here. The prisoners receive technical and dramaturgical support from young filmmakers like Anna. She's enthusiastic about the prisoners' dedication and talent. I never thought it would turn out so well. Using a camera isn't that easy. But the boys are doing quite a good job. <laughs> and so the clip, I Want Out of Here, also shows what the young prisoners can do. Authentic rap with a socially critical message. Here the perpetrators are the plaintiffs. And it sounds better than some of the stuff that makes it to the charts. 
Unsere Herzen sind gebrochen, aber nicht unser Glauben. Mir sagt ihr habt uns vertraut, Vater Staat hat uns versaut. Mann, ich lebe seit 18 Jahren hier. Und nach 18 Jahren Duldung redet ihr von, ich bin nicht integriert. Mann, ich konnte nur verlieren. Kein Pass, keine Arbeit. So geht es den meisten hier. Leben von der Hand in den Mund. Es nennt sich Hartz IV. So steckt die Habgier. So sind wir blind für das Böse und laden meist den Knast dafür. Für euch ist es ein Spiel, ein Spiel ohne Regeln. Für uns ist es ein Kampf, der Kampf uns überleben, den wir jeden Tag erleben. Wir könnt nichts unternehmen, nein, ihr wollt nichts unternehmen. Ihr wartet 